Hey everybody, so I'm here again today with another project share and this is for a swap that I hosted over on Junk Journal Junkies. I will put a link to the group in my description box uh, if you want to come over and be totally inspired. That is the group for you. Um, it's a super active group. Tons of amazing, amazing, talented ladies and guys. So um, this was a swap that I hosted. I It was the Strike a Pose swap and it was all um, camera based and like photo themed. So this is what I came up with. And it measures five and a quarter by seven and a quarter with the inside pages measuring five by seven. Um, I created it using medium weight or maybe it's lightweight chipboard. I, I didn't have any medium weight and I wish that I did but I didn't. So I use lightweight and it's sturdy but I, I like it to be a little heavier. But um, my partner ended up being Brenda. So this is Brenda's journal. There's two signatures. I put uh, book binding on the spine and then I painted it and I used teal and a mixture of what is this? This one is vintage white, so I kind of use mix those two together to to get this color. I have some banners on the front and a little woodsy camera woodsy, and then some stars. And I took two different colors of seam binding for my closure. And I just stamped the camera and then stamped oh shoot and then put the little heart right here. Yeah. And my paper, hmm, I can't remember you guys what paper I used. I think it was from a Maggie Homestack, but I really love the papers. I wanted to go kind of bright and cherry, not vintage. Um, that was what I had, had in my head. So on the inside cover, I just put some washi tape here. I put this craft envelope and then I made the two little uh, closures so that when Brenda receives it, she can use it and she can tuck some photos in there or whatnot. Then I printed these from the internet and then I just cut them out and made a little banner, put a little wood heart. Used all mostly all of my Cat's Life press stamps and printed a bunch of stuff off from the internet. A lot of photos uh, from Google and from Pinterest. I made this little uh, license plate. This is a My Favorite Things stamp and die set so I put smile have a nice day smile I love this stamp set and I don't use it very often and I should use it more so I just did that journaling space journaling lots of room for journaling here the ink ended up there so she can probably put a sticker or something um, here I left a spot for a photo then I have a big gigantic tag there. This is a Project Life card. Here I have a um, image from the internet. I love this washi. So pretty. So she can journal here, add a photo, whatnot. Some graph paper. I did put some tea dyed paper and also Kool-Aid dye paper. I love that butterfly. Here I just have a bag and then I put the journaling card tag on the inside. This is from Jelly Bean Soup, I think. A couple of tags there. Here I made a pocket. Printed this from the internet. And this is just a tag, more journaling space. An ordinary day. Put this little Polaroid, paper Polaroid, and then I stamped smile. love this one. 
Love that photo. Again, printed on the Red River paper. Amazing. Love that paper. Some stickers. Oops. Here's the story. Keep calm, take photos. A picture is worth a thousand words. And then I just added this little tag to the envelope. Definition of snapshot. Some book paper, little journaling tag. Second signature. Um, this is another printable. And then I just put a rub on, on this tag. It's so cute. Hope you saw that. It's not blurry. Little ticket. I stamped the word smile on that. This is another envelope. I love this one. I found this at Tuesday morning. What happens tonight goes on Facebook tomorrow. So how true is that? Oh, like this is, oh, I love this stamp set. This my, was my first time using it. It's called, what is that stamp set called? Simply Iconic. And it has all the oldies into it. So it has this one. And it says, this is how I roll. So it's like, um, film. A roll of film. You get like four stamp sets in the box. It's really, really cute. I'm going to take... That's that Daiso bag. It's not... I didn't coffee stain this one. So there is some room at the top for her to tuck stuff in. I stamped, oh shoot. And then this one. Photograph facts. Another pocket. In here I just put some, um, this journaling card and then some extra tickets that I stamped like the date where she can fill in the date whenever she um, needs to use them. A little camera quote. Keep calm and carry a camera. Two little Polaroids. That's from the Snapshot Collection by Die Cuts with a View. An oldie but a goodie for sure. This is from the Vintage Collector Stack. I love this paper. More journaling space. I really, really loved doing this journal. I love a camera themed. Anything camera themed. I just love it. I Heart Us. Photo of the day. Still trying to get used to this angle. Um, here is just another picture of a camera. Hello, my name is... Washi tape. I stamped there. Picture perfect, and then this is the back, and I put this book belongs to, so she can put her name on that, in the back. So that is my Strike a Pose photograph themed junk journal. So thank you so much everyone for watching, leaving me comments, uh, giving me a thumbs up, I really appreciate that. 
and I hope you're all doing well and having a great day and until the next time, bye everyone!